you're noticing that you can't send email from your BlackBerry device. Then you realize you haven't been receiving any email either. We need to do a little troubleshooting to determine where the problem originates. The first thing to check is that you have data services enabled. From the main screen, press the menu key and scroll down to Manage Connections. Press the trackball and scroll down to Mobile Network Options and press the trackball again. With data services highlighted, check that data services are on. If not, press the trackball and select on to enable data services. Incidentally, if you're going abroad and you don't want to pay hefty data charges, you may want to select the off when roaming option. You might think that because you can access the internet and view what you presume are web pages, then you have internet and so should be getting your email as well. But viewing pages through your device can be misleading. While the BlackBerry browser requires access to the internet through your device's web browser and the BlackBerry infrastructure, you might in fact be viewing WAP pages through a WAP browser. These days it can be hard to tell the difference between WAP pages and web pages on a mobile device. While viewing web pages requires the use of the BlackBerry browser and access through the BlackBerry infrastructure, viewing WAP pages uses the device's WAP browser which bypasses the BlackBerry infrastructure and just uses the wireless carrier's network. Check if you're using the device's BlackBerry browser or its WAP browser. From the main page, press the menu button. Scroll down and select Options. Select Advanced Options. Select Browser and check whether the BlackBerry browser is set as the default. If not, set it as the default and try to load a web page. So you've made sure the data services are enabled and you've set the BlackBerry browser as default. And now you can't load web pages. The next thing to determine is the status of the BlackBerry infrastructure with relation to the device. The easiest way to check that is by sending what's called a pin-to-pin -pin message from the device back to the device. From the main page, press the menu button and scroll down to Options and press the trackball. Scroll down to Status and press the trackball. Scroll to highlight the PIN number and press the menu button. Scroll to and select Copy PIN. Navigate back and select Messages. Press the menu button, then scroll down and select Compose PIN. At the message page, press the menu key and select Paste. You'll notice that the PIN number you copied earlier has been pasted into the To field. Press the trackball to accept the PIN number, then scroll down to the Subject field and type in Test. Press the menu key and select Send. You'll see an indication that an attempt has been made to send the message. If soon after you receive a message informing you that the attempt to send has failed, then there is a strong possibility that there is an issue with the BlackBerry infrastructure, the BlackBerry network that handles data services for the device. At this point there are several steps to take to resolve the problem. It's possible there's a device configuration issue. Try sending the service books to the device and see if that fixes the problem. If the problem persists, you will need to speak to your wireless carrier or, if you're using your company's BlackBerry Enterprise service, speak to the BEZ admin.